Good afternoon. I'm Kim Baez. Albuquerque police have arrested another man they say is connected to one of the largest chop shops ever busted in Albuquerque. Police say he was part of an elaborate scheme of stealing cars and then selling them back to the public, leaving many drivers with no idea the car they have is stolen. News 13's Jessica Gaudete is in the newsplex with more. Kim, today investigators say so far they have verified 20 stolen cars found at two businesses in Northeast Albuquerque, and they say there could be numerous others. Police say 43-year-old Bobak Saberin ran one of those businesses located on General Arnold Northeast. Police raided his shop and this one on Rhode Island Northeast Wednesday, where they found the stolen cars. Police also arrested Azum Tahir, who they say was the mastermind behind the very organized group of car thieves whose scams stretch across three states. Here's how the scam worked. Police say they would buy salvaged cars and take the VIN number from them. Then they would put that VIN number on a similar car they had stole. Police say the cars would been, then be sold at a cheap price to unsuspecting buyers. Obviously, any citizen could see that number. Go purchase this vehicle. They could actually get it registered under these fake numbers, not knowing that this vehicle they're actually riding around is stolen. Saberin confessed to police and said he profited from the scam. Police are still trying to identify how many vehicles they allegedly stole. Kim? Okay, thanks, Jessica. Now, Saberin faces several charges, including counts of receiving and transferring stolen vehicles and also charges of changing and altering engine numbers. He's being held on a $41,000 bond.